the rule number four for me is to be enthusiastic and to be concise. If one of my clients is hesitating between two candidates, my advice will always be to make the offer to the candidate who's more enthusiastic and who's more motivated. And positivity and enthusiasm are contagious. And if you can be enthusiastic when you talk, if you can be positive, then it's going to make the employer, the potential employer, feel positively about you. Obviously, you never want to criticize your previous employers. You never want to be negative about people. But if you can be positive, positivity is contagious and you reap what you sow. And that's going to differentiate you from so many of the other candidates that the interviewer will be meeting during that day. Because don't forget that very often an interviewer might have eight or 10 interviews in a day, and it can be very tiring. And I know what I'm talking about because I've been doing this for a very, very long time. And similarly, be concise, be precise, and be incisive. Unfortunately, the interview process can be quite stressful. And when people are stressed, they might have the tendency to talk too much and not to be concise enough. And if you can maybe practice before the interview, do some recordings and learn how to present your career in a positive way and in a very concise way, that's going to wake the interviewer out of his or her stupor. And it's going to make them remember you. And it's going to make you different from most of the other people that uh, the interviewer will have met during that day.